Thomas Paine stated, I believe in the equality of man, and I believe that religious duties consist in doing justice, loving mercy, and endeavoring to make our fellow creatures happy. Ronald Reagan said, A truly successful army is one that, because of its strength and ability and dedication, will not be called upon to fight, for no one will dare to provoke it. Freedom, independence, assurance. Patrick Henry eloquently stated, Liberty, the greatest of all earthly blessings, give us that precious jewel and you may take everything else. I am not well versed in history, but I will submit to your recollection whether liberty has been destroyed most often by the licentiousness of the people or by the tyranny of rulers. I imagine, sir, you will find the balance on the side of tyranny. We the people are the rightful masters of both Congress and the courts, not to overthrow the Constitution, but to overthrow men who pervert the Constitution. Abraham Lincoln. John Adams stated, Posterity, you will never know how much it cost my generation to preserve your freedom. I hope you will make good use of it. For if you do not, I shall repent from heaven that I ever took half the pains to preserve it. Thomas Jefferson said that our desire is to pursue ourselves the path of peace as the only one leading surely to prosperity. And our wish is to preserve the morals of our citizens from being vitiated by courses of lawless plunder. Thomas Jefferson said, resistance to tyrants is obedience to God. The administration of justice is the firmest pillar of government. Observe good faith and justice towards all nations. Cultivate peace and harmony with all. George Washington. James Madison once stated, how could a readiness for war at a time of peace be safely prohibited unless we could prohibit in like manner the preparations and establishments of every hostile nation. Outside Independence Hall, when the Constitutional Convention of 1787 ended, Mrs. Powell of Philadelphia asked Benjamin Franklin, well, doctor, what have we got? A republic or a monarchy? With no hesitation whatsoever, Franklin responded, a republic, if you can keep it. When the people fear the government, there is tyranny. When the government fears the people, there is liberty.